Hello everyone, Zcore here, and the god of medics is back to fail at climbing, uh, <laughs> climbing up, um, but I don't know why this medic wanted to boost up there, maybe he was waiting for the sniper or something, probably, because that makes much more sense, but um, we're gonna be playing with the Chiapa here. The skin version, of course. Aww. Oh, the skin, the gold dragon, or golden dragon, sorry, version of the Chiapa. Wait, what? That pistol had a skin that I did not think it had, if I'm not mistaken. Um, the Chiapa is, is it the latest shotgun? I'm not sure if it is the latest one, but it's a sort of a special shotgun. It's like a... It's not pump, it's auto, or fully auto, and it's um, only three bullets, only three bullets, but it is a very, three powerful bullets, three very powerful bullets, if I do say so myself. Oh, that was garbage aim, but I was just giving them warning shots, that's what that was, so do not worry. Oh shit, our teammates just got ticked up there. Let's see. I'm gonna stick to my NG teammate here so that I could farm him. I mean, res him. I mean, protect him. Um, <laughs> oh, we have a medic to revive here. They're planting on the site. Let's see if we can rebound that. Nope, of course not. That was also a warning. Oh my god. The movement. I completely missed this movement, <laughs> but um, this shotgun is very very powerful, but it has a very big limitation, which is that it has three bullets. So um, this is first impressions video, of course, and I haven't really played with it before. I think I played it like one stream, but I didn't use it much. Um, and I just did one FFA before this, and um, really that limitation of three bullets is is what really holds this gun back. And I don't know if I would place it below the um, K7. In terms of power and, and being able to kill enemies, it's definitely the first one, the strongest, but because of the very fact that, because of the very, very fact that um, it has three bullets, um, it's really limited in terms of like, uh, kill streak capabilities for sure. And even if like, you're facing one opponent or two opponents, then things can go wrong if they tank the bullets or like you miss one or two shots, as you've seen so far in this game. Because I've, I've, I think like twice now I've hit somebody with one shot and they and they haven't died. Um, so if you're not um, quick on your aim and and something goes wrong, it's, well that was bad. Things can go wrong pretty easily, and. Well, because it's three bullets, you won't really be able to kill enemies like in in a uh, consecutively. So, like I said, I was playing FFA, and it, it's not really good for FFA because as soon as you, as much as uh, start walking, you're out of bullets and you need to reload already. So that's something that's very bad. Oh shit! Where am I going? I don't know, but that's not what matters. Gotta see where these guys at. Oh shit. He's above me, I think. Oh shit. Oh. Got him. So one more, I believe. He's up, they say. I'm gonna bait you, I apologize. Where's my teammate, please? Should I rotate? Yeah, let's rotate. Um, so in FFA, as soon as you like, kill one person, two people, you're already like, um, 
in a pinch because like you know how FFA is like every person is like so cl there's so many people in FFA games that like social distancing is, is like an impossibility um, so you really can't um, it does have a very fast reload though that is I will give it that but still that doesn't mean that you can really challenge um, groups of people very easily you still I would say it's still better to like stay away from uh, groups of enemies because you're just really taking a very big risk especially with this game being Warface first talking about Warface here um, things can go wrong pretty easily and you shouldn't take that risk in my opinion okay that's one down but again it's very powerful um, and it reloads very fast so if you have confidence in your um, in your medicing skills in your shotgun skills then it is something you can use to play aggressively maybe to get like very um, to get some guaranteed easy picks easy kills maybe just thinking oh my god you see like there my my tracking was a little off and that guy survived um, with low HP relatively low HP why is, why is the enemy team leaving oh we are leading by three points I thought this was would have been like a balanced game and they had three medics so it would have been a good demonstration oh is it top um it would have been a good demonstration of, of what this gun is capable of. Um, but maybe... These guys might make it a bit harder because they're leaving. This is a great map for medics too, so that, that kind of helps. Oh. Oh, I was... I did not think he would get that because his aim was so slow. <laughs> Who is it that said what the fuck? <laughs> Is that infinity guy? Yeah. Why did he saying what the fuck? He just missed the shots. Oh my god. This guy is not gonna lose. Don't tell me. Where are you going? Oh. Please. What am I looking at? Okay. Thank you. But yeah. Um, as far as looks go. It's, it's pretty standard. Like I don't like it too much. Um, it's nothing impressive or original. Um, but the, the fact that it has a triple barrel makes it at least a little bit unique, to say the least. I should probably not separate from my team, since, you know, I am the god medic, but still. I'm gonna push or join our NG here. Oh, our teammate just got dicked up there. Or... Oh my god, he had the same <laughs> fucking plan as me. Nope. Come on. Oh my god, please. Okay, if, if he didn't get that one, I would have been so mad. Oh wow. Game's already over. Okay, we're gonna do another one <laughs> because that was way too short, but... Um, I hope at least I give you some idea of how the gun works. And keep in mind that I am playing on a EU server, so my connection isn't the best. So my shots aren't always going to like have the same fully. They're not going to have the same effect as you if you use it on, on your own server. Like, for example, when I hit somebody in like point blank and the tank, you might have better luck if you're doing it without lag and all that stuff. But anyways, we're going to hop on to another game and then yeah i'll be right back then okay guys we're back for a second round this time on the classic map yard the staple um warface ptb map sweat map oh shit please don't get me oh, snipers are ass so we made it through that's one obstacle down come on let me boost you mate go up here go up here or not, I'll go fuck myself. That works too. Um, so, uh, since we've already talked about the gun and everything, I'm just gonna focus a bit more on the game here. I'm gonna plant here. I'm gonna plant for. I'm gonna plant here because they have snipers and I wanna get sniped while planting. 
and we have people who we just have two rifles so it's not gonna um, planting out in the open isn't gonna help with anything I don't think okay one isn't going to spawn I'm gonna go here Okay, we got one. Oh, they're flashing from window, that is. Oh, I see you. <laughs> okay, let us not push up too far ahead. Oh. No, bomb. I'm sorry. <gasps> okay, I almost... <laughs> my... <laughs> My planting skills almost <laughs> bit us in the ass. I was also gonna say, um, my last medic video, even though I'm like the god of medics, some of you guys were triggered that I don't aim down set when I <laughs> use my shotgun. Um, but, and a lot of people were like, why aren't you doing it? Do you have like some sort of cancer that prevents you? Um, and shit like that, but, um, my explanation, my excuse for not um, aim ADSing is just the fact that it's not my play style. Like, I enjoy that freedom of, of, of uh, that laid back gameplay that you can get playing as a medic, just not having to. Is that a person there? Uh, nope, it was not a person. Ha not having to um, aim downside and just like. Walking around, hip firing. I feel that's like very sort of liberating. If that makes any sense. So that's why I I usually don't aim downside when I'm playing as a medic. But when it's like more hardcore, hardcore, uh, more um, sweaty situations or more, more sweaty games, I will aim downside. So that includes like uh, videos so that you guys don't get triggered. <laughs> Just don't worry about that in that sense. Am I being too aggressive here? I think I'm gonna get shot in the ass. Well, no, he's probably going the long way. Maybe he's AFK? He was not AFK. But he did tank like two shots, I think. I think I spent all my bullets there to kill him. <clears throat> Personally, this is not my favorite shotgun. I don't know if I said that before. But it is a very strong and fun one to play with. Like, but again, just sort of like snipers, all shotguns are, almost all shotguns are fun for me to use because they all have like their, not only because of the fact that I, I usually play, um, oh, what the hell happened? WH aimbot? Who has, who's WH? I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Um, <clears throat> Because I usually play like rifle, rifle and SM, um, engineer on my main classes, and with those classes, you always gotta like try hard and aim for the head. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, we're not gonna talk about <laughs> that one. <laughs> my throw just completely gave up on me there. Um, can I res my guy? Oh, can get a kill though. We oh shit! Fuck, they baited me. <laughs> I got my team, my dead teammate baited me. Oh god, that body, body is covering my teammates. What was I saying before that voice crack? R completely threw me off my trail of thought. <laughs> um, oh, I'm completely lost now. Oh shit. Oh, is this guy gonna make it? Let's pick. Pulled out the big strats with the pistol. That's how you play sniper properly. You just pistol. At least nowadays. Oh my god, what was that? <laughs> Zurich. Oh! Oh my god, no. What? <laughs> how did he get him? That is so weird. <laughs> what did I just witness? Um, I'm trying to think, what the hell was I talking about? That is so weird. It's completely- oh, you saw him. He was like, crab walking away. He or she. Because they had a female skin. I'm- I'm completely lost. Maybe I'll- 
I'll probably rewatch the the footage here and, and write add a caption or a note as to what I was talking about to complete it. She's in the smoke, dude. Oh my god, I don't like this. I don't like this one. <gasps> Behind you! Oh my god, what's happening? Oh. That was, that was not a bad play. Like, that was a bit of a 200 IQ play. <laughs> uh, okay, let me trace back. What the... Oh yeah, I was talking about why I sort of enjoy all, all shotguns. So, you know... Playing rifles as SMGs, it requires you to aim and all. Um, but then when you switch to snipers or shotguns, it's, it's like a completely different style of play and all. So, and it's pretty refreshing to go for that. If that makes any sense. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh, that, that sniper is on point with his aim. Was that a good call out? I don't know if mid really would signify that. Oh, please sniper. Don't let me down here. Oh, you let me down. Oh, but the other sniper didn't. Oh, oh the nade is on point with these guys. Oh, no, please. These guys are going to blow each other up. <laughs> they didn't know how to play their mind. <laughs> That's funny. Don't blow it up, please. <laughs> Okay. So yeah, as far as snipers go, all of them are like pretty unique in the way that they shoot and like the combination of their recoil, their RPM and all that stuff makes them nearly all of them fun to play with. And shotguns sort of same thing, but to a lesser degree, I'd say. Um, a lot of them, I don't play shotgun, I don't play medic a lot, so I, like I said, it's not most of them. It's not the case for most of them, if I remember correctly. Wow, that guy just teabagged me after he killed me. I'm gonna ask if he... <laughs> Why would he teabag me? Does he think like... <laughs> when he said report, was he talking about me for some reason? <laughs> That'd be funny. So yeah, um, gosh, I'm so non-concise -con with whatever topics I'm fucking talking about all the time. Oh no! You see, like, I should've, you gotta reload at every opportunity with this gun. Like, otherwise, you're, you're shooting yourself in the foot. Oh! Is that a triple collat? No, I think that was not a triple, right? I think that was a double collapse. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn. This guy has a pretty similar name to me too, at least the second part of his name. Zior. <laughs> that was interesting for me to see. So yeah, um, I think that's enough. I'm going to stop here. Probably win this. Yep. So yeah, uh, I hope that those those games in this video sort of gave you an idea of what this shotgun is and plays like and feels like. Um, personally, again, because of the low amount of bullets and because I'm not always super consistent with my aiming and tracking, target tracking, um, I would not opt in for this. Uh, not only aiming and bullet and, and track target tracking, but also like. Um, situational awareness and like the sort of knowledge and play style that you need for um ptb game modes where like s sometimes you need to stay at your position reload like stuff like that if you're if you have mastery over all of those um and on top of that you have pretty good aim and and target tracking this shotgun will probably not be a problem for you to use uh, but it will still limit you if you are facing several opponents at the same time. So you could use it in, in PTB and those games was fine. But it, when it comes to FFA, you're really just shooting yourself in the foot. Um, 
I'm gonna try to go with this one because um, with three bullets against 16, 15 other players on the same map with how small the maps are and how bad the spawns are, um, anybody else with like a, uh, a shotgun that has 10 bullets or however many more bullets is going to have a much easier time than you. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope I, I used my aim, I aimed down sight a bit more this time so you guys are less triggered. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.